Hi friends, in this session we will discuss one of the common interview question, reverse a number. Unlike string, integer does not provide any inbuilt method to extract digit by digit and then reconstruct it in a reverse way. We need to find a different technique here. We have to use division by 10 to extract digit by digit. We need to use multiplication by 10 to reconstruct the number in reverse way. Let's take this example, do multiple iterations and we will see how we will reverse the number. So in first iteration, we will, we will divide this number by 10. That means n percent 10 percentile 10 which gives a reminder here so that is 5. We will store this into another number called reverse and as a second step we will do n equal to n by 10. So this became 289. So now in the second iteration we want to do the same operation n percent 10 in this case n is 289 we will get 9 as a reminder but we don't want to assign 9 as it is to reverse variable what we do we will multiply previous reverse value with 10 and add this reminder to that that means rev to 10 plus 9. So in this case REV is 5, it's 50 plus 9 which is 59 and again as usual n will be n by 10 in this case it's going to be 28. So now in third iteration we'll continue the same process um in by n percentile 10 a reminder will be 8 again we'll multiply the previous reverse value with 10 which is 59 into 10 and add reminder here 590 plus 8 598 and n became n by 10 in this case 20 by 28 by 10 is 2 then 4 the fourth step again same process we will multiply 598 into 10 and in this case the remainder if, if you divide 2 with the 10 the remainder will be 2 and it's 5980 plus 2, 5982, which is reversed. Let's write a code. Create a new class. Reverse number. And I'm going to have one main method here. Let me write a static method which returns int reverse number. It takes an input as an integer int num and let's define reverse value or ev reverse. Initially, I'll define this to g0. At the end, I will return the same number reverse. So now I need to iterate the number and I have to perform division and multiplication. So I'll use while loop here. So what is the exit condition in while loop? If number not equal to 0, I'll keep performing same operation again and again. So num 
not equal to 0 I will continue division and multiplication so now as a first step I need to get the remainder that's num percent 10 and I need to assign this to reverse this is the first iteration I don't want to put any condition just for first iteration but I'll just slightly adjust so it will be common for every iteration so initially we initialize reverse with 0 so reverse multiply by 10 plus the remainder so what happens in this case the first iteration always reverse will be 0 anything you multiply with 10 I mean uh, anything you multiply with 0 will be 0 and then we are assigning the remainder here so in first iteration always by default we assign a remainder to reverse the second iteration onwards the previous value will be multiplied with 10 and the new remainder will be added to here so now number will be divided by 10 and will be used for next iteration so this is the logic to reverse a number let's test the code system dot out dot println reverse number in this case i'll give 5643 and i just want to print here 5643 reverse ace now let's add a couple of other numbers 873901 90776 now we'll run this and see the result so now 5643 the reverse is 3465. 873901, the reverse is 109378. 90776, the reverse is 67009. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe to the channel.